Hello everyone, and welcome back to another tutorial on the Simply Development YouTube channel. In today's tutorial, I'll be teaching you how to set up a .exe file to run your Discord bots from or whatever you're running. Instead of opening a PowerShell window every time and typing no to dot every time you want to run your bot. Now this might be something that a lot of people already know how to do, but I didn't really know how to do it until Aiden told me that I could actually do this. So it'll probably help out a lot of people that don't know that they can do this or don't know how to do this. So let's get started. So first you want to open whatever editor your pro program that you're using. I use Visual Studio Code. So then you want to go to File, New File, and then it'll open it entitled, and then do File, Save As, and then you want to find where you want to save the run file to. I'm just going to put it in the Red Cord Support Bot, and then you want to name it Run, and then instead of plain text, you want to look for the batch thing. Batch, and then save it. So then you want to do at echo off. And then you just want to do node dot. So then file, save, and then you want to go run this program. So then you want to navigate to where you saved the batch file to. I saved mine to the red code support bot folder. So then you want to run the batch file, whatever you named yours to, mine was run. So then it'll start running like normal, but then it'll be in a .exe file. So then it'll say connecting to Discord, everything that it does, or whatever your bot is. That's just what mine says. And now my bot has started up. It says connected, now listening to DMs. Hopefully you enjoyed that tutorial, and hopefully that tutorial helped you create an .exe file so then you can run your Discord bots easier. If that tutorial did help you, please give it a like, subscribe for more tutorials in the future, and I'll see you guys in the next tutorial. Peace.